Hey YouTube, it's your girl Jazz and I'm back with another video. Today's video will be on a Kurt Geiger unboxing, so if y'all want to see the item that I have, keep on watching. I see you look good out on me, call. no lashes, even better when you're waiting, call. Oh, oh, oh. I see the look on your face. Alright ladies and gents, thank y'all so much for clicking on my face to see another unboxing. This will be a first impressions bag review on a bag that I had my eyes on for a while. Once I saw it on the website, I was like, hmm, this is different. It's not a Kensington. It's not like a mini bag. This is a top handle, and I am intrigued because it's similar to a bag that I have on my wish list from another fashion house. So this is the box. I already like halfway opened it, but not the actual package. So we are going to do it together. So this is how it came in. And then this is like my receipt. But um, so that was the bag. That was the box. And then the receipt. And let's get right into it. Oh my goodness. I've seen this bag in person already. So I got to hold it and see. But now it's mine and it's in my collection. I have to find a spot for her on the wall. But okay. So let me open it. And I don't have a bag like this in my I'm lying. I do have a black top handle bag. But I mean not this size. That's what I'll I will say. I don't have a black top handle. Ooh y'all. Is it giving a Coco Chanel handle like the dupe? the bougie on a budget but y'all oh and it feels so good uh, this is the kurt geiger top handle bag it doesn't really have any other name than that so if you search it on like google this bag will come up in black gold hardware y'all see the gold rhinestones on that eagle and it feels so smooth like I need let me see what kind of leather this is let me look real quick I want to say because I think let me let me just look it up Kurt Geiger top handle see it's the first one to come out so it retails for $265 and mm, this smell like leather so it doesn't say what kind of leather it is it just says exterior leather, interior fabric lining. This Kensington top handle purse features a black leather exterior with weave over stitch quilting design. There is a black pocket in the back and antique brass eagle head on the front flap. The back can be worn across the body or held with the structured top handle. But nonetheless, y'all, so cute. So. It does have a back pocket there, which I do appreciate for like basically putting your phone or like a card holder. But let me take off this plastic on the actual top handle so y'all can see it. Oh my goodness. Y'all, now if he brings out more colors, cause what color do I need next? I feel like I need a pink one. If he brings out a pink, oh baby. And I feel like I think he went with black cause he just wanted to test the waters to see like, you know, anybody looking anybody want to try out this bag because i have not seen nobody do a bag review or even show this bag or show interest in this bag like i did a tiktok of of it when i went to the millennial mall to see like the the first kurt geiger here in the u.s and i saw it in person but it's like nobody didn't really care except me like but y'all this is like another level of kurt geiger i feel like and I think this is from the, he considers this like the pre-fall collection. But it looks, it looks so good. It has feet at the bottom with that gold brass color. Now let's get into the inside. And then of course, I'm going to show y'all what fits because why not? But I love this bag because it's like you could dress it up or dress it down. Similar to like the, um, the cocoa handle. I feel like you could dress that bag up or down. But this is like a great evening bag for sure because it's not too big and like all in the way 
but it's like a medium size that will fit you know all of your essentials and then it just looks classy i'm just taking off the, off the packaging then it does come with a dust bag oh this dust bag is no it's the same but this is the dust bag that it comes with more packaging you know to keep it straight and this is a little bag tag uh, all right so oh i like how this strap is too is this detachable yes okay so this is a different type of detachable strap but i like it but we'll get into it so this is the inside it's just one big opening there like one compartment and then it does have a built-in pocket on the back there and then it has the details. It says the Kensington, right? Yeah, it says the Kensington there. <clears throat> and then look at the strap, y'all. So let me actually take it. Can I take it out? Hmm. Yeah, okay. So this is the strap. Is it adjustable? Yes, it is adjustable. It feels kind of flimsy, I'm not going to lie. I felt like I felt better bag straps than this but nonetheless feels good but look at how um it's um detachable it's like look at the ends see and then you just loop it in so you know like how usual crossbodies is like a hook and you like pull it and then this one it's a little different when i do the what's in my bag to give y'all like the details of what all fits y'all will see but i thought that was that's different. I like that. So I'm just looping it back in if I can. All right. There that goes. And then let me put it on the other side. But yes, I'm excited to have this. Like, like I said, I don't have a um, top handle bag and I've been looking at the Coco handle. Well, not been looking like I'm going to buy it anytime soon, but I do appreciate that bag a lot like i love it so much anytime i see like my followers with it my mutuals i'm just like oh, that bag is so cute and classy and it's just <sighs> so good it's so good but this will do for now i feel like it's doing what i need what the cocoa handle would do because it has like this top handle but then you could also wear it as a shoulder bag you could wear it can you wear it crossbody probably yeah, this actually don't feel bad on me crossbody either. See? So crossbody. And shoulder. And then top handle. Real cute. So now let's do what fits inside. This beauty. She looks so good. Like they really need one. I feel like they he needs to make like a cream one next and a tan one because this is like pre-fall. I feel like an ivory color would look good. I feel like a cobalt blue would look good with gold detail and then um, peanut butter tan. If he does those next, yeah. And for $265, alright let's get into the wet bits. All right, y'all. I just want to show y'all. <sighs> this bag is so pretty. Like, look at the details. The stitching. The feet at the bottom. Kirk, you really outdid yourself, okay? Okay. Like, ugh. excuse me. Like, <laughs> just get into her. Just get into her. All right, so really quickly, let me show y'all the inside that I was telling you about with the detachable straps. Well, first, let's get into the top. Kirk Geiger London on the top there. Love that. And then this is the handle. All right, now let's get to the inside. All right, so there it is, the Kensington. Then it has like the fabric um, material. And then it's just like a big, oops. A big opening there with like the signature you know Kurt Geiger logo going on but look at the straps now so you see this is how you 
hook it in and take it off on both sides and yeah so cute and this is definitely like a good amount i like that it's just one big compartment so let's fill it up with my essentials all right so i have my um card holder there i have my portable charger i have my compact mirror i have a mini um hand sanitizer oops stay open i have my um key holder and then i feel like i need to add my mini pochette before i put anything else <laughs> So this house is like all my lippies, hand cream, pen. So I add that in there. And look, still room for more. So I could probably move this and put it right there. And then my cute AirPods. And that's pretty much the essentials that I carry. But as you can see, more can fit in there. But y'all know i don't really carry much yeah y'all look at her oh my goodness <laughs> so good so let me see what size bag i can compare it to i feel like i can compare it to like the ysl lulu so i'm gonna grab that and put them side by side all right so these are both and <laughs> look at the details of course this one is a little bit wider but height wise and this is the lulu small they are this oh i'm sorry they are the same height of course this one has feet um and then this has a top handle that just has the double um shoulder strap but uh, yes looks so good i'm so happy to have this now i just gotta find a spot for her on my shelf hmm good luck with that <laughs> all right so i added my glamaholic there and oh i don't know i forgot about this part i have to adjust the shelves because she's definitely gonna go right there all right y'all perfect perfect ah! all right everybody's happy and this is going to be my collection for a minute because when I say <laughs> I don't have any more room, yeah, I still want a black and white bag, but I am taking a pause. Yeah. So back to the handbag reviews of stuff that I have in my collection already. My Betsy Johnson snailed it purse just goes right there, but um, I'm using her for another bag review, so yeah all right y'all so thank y'all so much for watching i hope y'all enjoyed and i will see y'all in the next one i love y'all bye